Tonight, the dangerous craze sweeping the country fueled by social media. It's a reckless drinking game where many are pushing the boundaries to perilous new limits. Hey on guys, Nick Nominate, this is a new game. Drink, drink, drunk, the room starts to and I uh, nominate drink, Jimmy Bowler. Drunk, hand out of hand, on top of the world, taking out the man. My next net nomination is... Thanks, Pat, for the net nomination. I'm going to net nominate. I'm net nominate. Oh, yeah. Now net nominate. Net nominations. This scale. Thanks, Pat, for the net nomination. It doesn't get any dumber than this. Cheers, I'd like to next nominate Victorian Police and Zach Cowan. Cheers. Drinking while driving, then posting online for all to see. They're just plain stupid. I mean, who are these people? What do they think they're doing? Extreme next nomination. Clip after clip, the drunken dares are aimed at pushing the boundaries while abusing alcohol. And just like a chain letter, the viral craze called Neck Nominate is spreading. In its simplest form, Neck Nominate means to film yourself sculling a pint of beer and then uploading the clip online. At the end of the video, the participant nominates a mate to do the same. Well, the thing is, we all did stupid things when we were young. I and mean, we all drank too much, we all did silly things. But now with the internet, it turns a small cult into a mainstream culture. Herald Sun columnist Susie O'Brien says this takes the Australian drinking culture way too far. I mean, these kind of losers think it's a one big joke. But it's, they're playing with people's lives. It's a really dangerous thing to do. Thanks, Jenna and Tim, for the nomination. And it's not just blokes. Girls are getting on the action too. This person, who appears underage, sculls a bottle of beer while walking through a McDonald's restaurant at night. So, where did this all begin? It's believed that the neck nominate trend kicked off at a private college in Western Australia where one silly student uploaded the first video and called on two of his best mates to do the same. They did and then invited all of their other friends. It's now spread right across the country with hundreds of videos being uploaded in the last several days. You can't pick what's going to become the next big social media thing. Uh, that's, it's, it's an impossibility. But there are elements to a lot of the ones that become quite popular. Things such as young people involved again. This isn't something adults are involved with. It's something adolescents are involved with. As well as things like element of danger and risk. Dr Lauren Rosewarn is a social media expert at Melbourne University. She says while the videos may seem harmless, they can have dire consequences down the track. Uh, once you're an adult, once an employer starts Googling you for a background information, you're going to have a track record of being involved in all kinds of online pranks, Facebook photos, etc. So you have to decide whether that's the print that you want to be leaving. On buses and in bed, the immaturity has no end, even for Batman. But while the common theme here seems to be Gen Y, don't be fooled. Some of their parents are just as stupid. Crema has nominated you. Thanks, Crema. Dr Matthew Fry is the head of clinical services at Turning Point, a drug and alcohol research centre. He believes it's important to showcase these sorts of clips in an effort to prompt discussion about what not to do. We need a culture and we need to change in our view of alcohol to recognise that it's a drug. And it's incidents like these that can cause serious harm. I neck nominate Jack Verhurl and uh, Angus Hedges. Oh, oh hey bro. You Oh, yeah, Superintendent oh. Neville Taylor from Victoria Police is so frustrated by this behaviour, he issued this statement today. This man's behaviour is incredibly risky. This is totally inappropriate behaviour and I would expect the community to join me in condemning it. We've got such a culture of alcoholic excess, it's hard to see how kids are going to be, make the right decisions. I nominate you all. Thank you.